Oh, new honey's already coming on. Okay. Whoa. Gotcha. Okay. So, what's to harvest? Olives are ready to harvest, but we already discussed it's not worth our time to even rent an olive harvester for two small rows. So that's just going to stay there as decoration. It's our olive garden next to our rock garden. And this is our canola field still growing. I think that's got to sit over the winter. And these are empty. Okay. What do we want to grow next? If we wanted to do wheat and barley, we'd do it now. But we have an oilery, so all our money is going to be in canola. Which we already planted, apparently. Oh, that's right. Yeah, we missed the window. And sunflowers. Okay. Fair enough. We should probably just start picking these up. I think we have already a special bucket that chops sugar beets. Yeah. Oh, and we brought a whole front loader with it. Fair enough. Okay, so we better get started on that, I guess. This is turning into a sugar beet episode that I did not plan on. I'm going to have to pick up our oil later. Okay. And Dini. In. You attach? Yes. Yes. All right. And we're stuck. <laughs> Try it again. What are, what are we even stuck on? Oh, maybe this bucket is clipping something. All right. And this doesn't look like a very big weight, but might as well use it. Maybe I can pretend it's actually possible to lift that because it's small. Wow, that looks pretty small compared to the one we have in France that's bigger than our tractor. Okay, so you're here to start scooping. Let's bring our trailer over. Whoa. I hope it's empty. If we have to empty this, empty issues. All right, nothing in the trailer. Let's fire up the versatile. Yeah, <laughs> I love that. Oh, this town's gonna hate me with good reason. Okay, this should be. Ooh. Okay, I'll just leave this here. Something like this, maybe. Okay, let's try this out. Oop. Get this flat. Okay. And all right, can we scoop up some? Oh yeah, nice. Scoop up those sugar beets. All right. So we should have a bucket full of sugar beets. Which, uh, look at that. We sure do. Good job, Louis. Oh, you don't have your beacons on, Louis. That's a citation. Now, if I know how to work this correctly, which is a massive if, the bottom should chop up our sugar beets. We are kind of floating. I think we're going to need a bigger weight. Okay. And let's see. What's the button here? Turn on front loader tool. There we go. We're chopping. Chopping sugar beets. Nice. 
Nice. That looks dangerous. All right. When is prime chopped sugar beet selling season? Well, we got to get a distillery going. Or maybe a brewery. Maybe brewery. Feels more Canadian. Where's sugar beets? Did I miss it? Cut sugar beets. Also January. What's going on in January? All right. Well, we'll wait for January, I guess. But where are we going to store these things? I mean, maybe we don't need the trailer for anything else, but we'll probably need it. Uh, we're going to have to figure this out. After we collect all this. Ooh. Should I? Time lapses? Uh. Oh, the bucket's too high. That was the title of my first jazz album. The bucket's too high. Okay. Here we go. Whoa. It's, it's nice and easy here. Okay. Cool. Cool. Uh, me, oh, whoa. You know what? Uh, maybe we should just go ahead and invest in a heavier weight. Okay. Chop these up good. Nom, 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 nom. Okay. Uh, oh. Let's lower the weight. No. I mean, I don't imagine we'll get much for selling it, so I'll just get it out of the way. How much would we get? Out of curiosity. Okay, nothing says things we own. Wait. Get five hundred dollars for that little sucker. Where's this one? Oh, we have a thousand pound weight somewhere. Show on map. Yes, that would be okay. Bring up the map. Uh, well, where is it? Huh? That's us. Where's the weight? Don't make me click everything. <laughs> There's our plow in the neighbor's yard. Is it here or not? No. Screw you, game. You are a liar. You're a filthy, dirty liar. I do not have this weight anywhere. Screw you. I'm going to sell off this fictional weight. And get a new one. That's what I think of you, game. <laughs> now that we got that out of our system. Let's buy a weight. Okay, well, that one was 600. Let's, oof, these, these are really big. Well, that's the front way. That's uh, 2,500. I mean, sounds big enough. A thousand? Is a thousand good? Do we need 1,600? I don't even, 30, whoa. We have a, who knew you had so many options when choosing weights? Uh, 1100 yeah 1.1 1 .1 metric tons well should we get it to match the landini doesn't have a landini thing white's always good that matches the landini too all right we'll take it there we go now we should stop um dangerously floating around the farm easy up 
Okay, let's see if this keeps us steady. If not, maybe I'll just balance both on here. We should start with this leftover stuff here. Okay, get this flattened out. And we pick this up. Did we pick it up? Yeah, it looks like we did. Let's see here. Can I go a cool side front view? Does this look better? It's more compelling content? Not really, but okay. Ooh. Whoa. Okay. And stop. Looks like we can pick up a little more here. Let's go ahead and grab this. Now nah, we're full. Let's see. Oh, we're still we're still dancing a bit. Look at that. I guess I should have got an even bigger weight. Yeah. Well, it's better than it was before. We'll make two. Please don't roll over. I have a pretty good streak of not rolling over in the last few videos. I like to keep that intact. Okay. Close enough. There we go. Yeah, look at it go. Delicious sugar beets. I think in the new production mods that came with FS22, there's a... I think you can get a sugar mill and turn your beets into sugar. And then when you if you get a bakery, you can combine that with wheat and eggs if you make those and then you have a cake factory. That's pretty that's pretty cool. I got to say they really came around this year adding in the production buildings. I think once we get our barn established and pay off some of our crippling debt, we could probably get a dairy going. Make some good Canadian cheese. Can we make cheese curds? Hey, there's a license plate. Nice. And we ran over the old weight. Maybe we can make some trademark Oka cheese. Whoa. Easy now. Well, that weight is uh, still not enough, but all right. Let's just keep going with this. Well, at this rate, this is definitely going to be the whole episode. That's okay. I'm, I'm entertaining and engaging. I'm sure you're all here for my witty commentary. Not for the satisfying farming footage. Oh, look, we're done uh, with our field. Maybe it's, uh, I don't know. Wait, oh, let me see something here. Okay, right now. Let's see. The sugar beets would be this value. So in January, can we say that's double? Let's pretend it's double. So we could get about $600. Oh, it's on euros. <laughs> That's a holdover from the French farm, isn't it? Okay. Uh, we'll get 600 euros. Like, this could be profitable. Maybe we have to uh, think about putting our cow barn somewhere else. I don't know. What do you think about that, folks? Wait, is it even realistic to buy a cow barn just before winter? Should we be buying cows in, like, spring or something? Look, this may surprise some of you. But I'm not actually a farmer. I know. I know. I talk a good game. 
show a lot of realism and real knowledge. But I'm not really sure how the whole cows things work. I mean, we'll figure it out. How hard could it be? You're just two ton living mammals. Should sort himself out pretty much. Like Louie, he's about half a ton. He doesn't need much. You give him a TV and some Molsons, he's good for at least two, three days. Alright. This is slow going, isn't it? I might have to switch this to time lapse. Out of <laughs> mercy for all you people listening. And by all you people, I mean my doctor, hello, and Fred, how you doing? Still stuck on seven. Really want to get to ten. If only so I can release that huge field prep time lapse thing I recorded a week ago when I thought, wow. We are on an upward trajectory. We'll get 10 subscribers in no time. Uh, current projections have it at uh, sometime mid-2023. We should get to 10 subscribers. So look forward to that. Basically, I want to get 10 subscribers before Farming Simulator 2024 comes out. Let's see if we can do that. That'll be good. This trailer looks like it's getting pretty full, actually. You know what? We might want to take a moment here to see what we can do with these. Does the versatile have beacons? No. You rebel. Okay, I'm going to try and see if the auger will take him and put him into our silo. And if not, I I don't know what we're going to have to do. Louie, how many times I tell you not to leave your toys in the middle of the field? Look, there's our box of sugar beets from last year. How you doing? And we probably won't be needing this massive, expensive mower kit. If this is going to be the extent of our grass field going forward. But that's another problem for another episode. Okay. Oh, let's bring up the HUD just so we can see what's going on. 311 euros. Louis is not worth 311 euros. All right. Well, let's see what happens. If it doesn't say unload, actually, let's straighten this out a little more. Make it a little easier for us. I'm going to cut down this tree. Oh, 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 okay. Let's not drive up the pole. Okay, this is, this is just... Okay. Okay, I'm going to get the big censored sticker up. There we go. Let's just go ahead. And... Hey, why are you doing this? Maybe the articulated trailer tractor wasn't the best choice for this. Okay, I just need to get it in the vicinity to see if it'll even accept. I have a pretty strong feeling it won't, but if it does, that'll solve our problems. No. Oh boy. So we got several tons of chopped sugar beet with nowhere to put. Just double check. Oh, don't move it. it takes forever to find. I mean, if I just do unload here, it's not going to work, is it? Hmm. Well, what do we do? Okay. 
we're going to dump them in the barn. I think, given the circumstances, that's our most quasi-realistic option. Whoa. I mean, what else can we do with them? Hold on a second. Let me check the new mods. Maybe we have something affordable. Hmm. What is this? Shelter with solar roof. Well, that's good, but... Whoa. <laughs> it's pretty big. There's this. I mean, we could put them in here, but this costs $25,000, and then there goes any hope of a profit. So, 6000 uh, silos. Maybe if there's some kind of modded silo that just kind of takes everything. Uh, okay. Silo. This silo can be filled with different products. Do you want to tell me what they are? Because that would be really useful. Underground pallet storage. Well. Wow. Okay. Okay, we just gotta leave it in the barn. What else can we do with it? Let's get the Massey out of the way. I mean, we could leave it in one of the barns without doors, but... I okay. get... It's slightly better if we have it in here. Uh, okay, let's go with that. Oh, this is going to be fun. Easy. Oh. Okay. No. It's not giving me the option to unload here. That's a little worrisome. Okay, I can't unload it here. Okay, people. We have several tons of chopped sugar beet. We need to hide somewhere. Uh, let's ballpark. Um, I'll take anything. I mean... Uh, this would be a lot easier if the silos took sh chopped up sugar beets. Okay, okay, wait a second. How about... There was a machine that put sugar beets into crates. Does it also put... Oops, wrong button. Chopped sugar beets into crates. Where's the thing? Oh, it's under conveyor belts, isn't it? This thing? No, it only does hold... Sugar beets. Last option. Can we dump these over here in the shed? We'll pretend there's a tarp over them or something. Ooh. I like that I make Japanese anime sound effects whenever I'm backing up. Ooh. Oh. Yeah. Unload here. I will, thank you. Let's go ahead and move the box. Next to our wind rower. Alright. I can't think of anything else, so we're gonna go with this. Hey, what happened to unload here? Thank you. There we go. Yeah, just pretend there's a tarp on it. And we're fine. And we hit the roof. Okay, I'm gonna say stop unloading. And just, uh... We'll get back to filling. Wow, we've barely done a quarter. Alright, folks. I think I'm going to have pity on you and 
time lapses. Because otherwise I'm gonna just be babbling for at least half an hour, looks like. So enjoy. Welcome to Jurassic Park. did our sugar beets end up under the trailer? What what the heck is that? Game, work with me, please. It's hard enough I have nowhere to put these, and you don't give me a silo that'll take them. I don't need trailers with holes in the bottom. Alright, back to the time list. It's happening again. Okay. We gotta do something about this. Let's go. Versatile. Okay. This is not anything I imagined I'd have to do, but here we are. I will now scoop up the chopped sugar beets that fell through my trailer and I hit a rock. Uh, you're not going to let me scoop up chopped sugar beets? Game? It's starting to piss me off, game. Okay, maybe I need to get dump this first. There we go. Can't mix crops in the bucket. Okay, and then scoop up this. There we go. Okay, game, I forgive you. How many? Okay. Let's dump. Can we double chop our sugar beets? Extra fine sugar beet powder? It's like icing sugar, only it's turnipy. Okay, please don't go through the trailer. We can double chop our <laughs> sugar beets. Eh, let's pretend it's easier than just dumping it. Double chop. That's a pretty good marketing beginning. Eh? Why buy Guillaume's sugar beets, chopped sugar beets, when Louis's chopped sugar beets are double chopped? Oh, wow. I've been buying single chopped sugar beets like an idiot. Yes, you have, sir. Come right this way. Double chop, double the price. I'll pay anything. Me <laughs> some What's wrong with me? All right, I'll go back to time lapse now. Oh, 
feel like a long time it felt like a long time for me doing it in regular speed i might put that in super fast but still i think it's probably gonna be oh there's a little window here we can see our chop sugar beet Whew. so we have our big pile over there and i think that's gonna do it for this episode I'll clean up a little bit here, and we'll get some sleep, and we'll come back tomorrow. It should be November. We can we'll pick up our canola from our oilery. It should be ready to go. Let's see, when's the best time to sell canola oil? No, sunflower oil. That's a, week. a good price. Wait a second. So we're here. We got to hold on to it till February. February. All right. That's what we'll do. Until next time. Hey. Thanks for watching. No, really. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. And, uh, you know, you have some ideas. Let me know. I'll try anything. Well, that's not true. Whoa. 152 yuck. All right. Cheers. Sit, Ubu, sit. Good dog. Here come the Simpsons, baby. This week is kind of videos you want to watch, and Blockbuster Video enforces your wishes. Why are we still here? Just to suffer?